have Isabella Shimalecki from Contractors Protection Agency in the studio today. Contractor Protection Agency provides services to small contractors including GST prep, contract amendment, drafting, payroll, to lien filing, and other business related tasks. Welcome Isabella. Thank you. Isabella, tell me how this business got started. Um, the business actually came from the heart. Um, my husband's a contractor mm -hmm. and being in construction industry for such a long time, I've seen the struggles those little companies go through, mm -hmm. like the clients not paying when the job is completed. Okay, um, like um, for example, the job is in progress and there needs to be an amendment done, but the contractor, well, he's hands on. He he not doesn't always understand that a piece of paper mm -hmm. can make you or break you. Um, so I had to teach him that, mm -hmm. that when something needs to be changed, we need to do an amendment to the contract. So we do that as well for clients, because they need to understand the importance of it. Even if it's just a plug mm -hmm. that needs to be changed, we need to write up a paper on that. So learning all those little things through the years have helped me understand what they need and where they need to go with this and how they need to proceed. The contracts we draft for them, they're bonding. Uh, they're approved by CHMC, which is very important. So that's pretty much how we got started, just because I knew what they need done. Excellent, excellent. And of course, with having the background in the industry already, um, is your husband's a contractor. Yes. So, so, you've Still is. <laughs> <laughs> so you've gone through all this, I'm sure, yourself in a number of occasions. Uh -huh. Okay, that's wonderful. It's good, it's good practical experience, too. And I think that's really important in the industry in this day and age to have the inside scoop on what's needed to be done. Uh, so what are the services that you provide? Sounds something like a lawyer or a paralegal would usually do for a contractor with the liens. Um, is that necessary? No, not really. What people don't realize, um, a lawyer or a paralegal will simply put their stamp on it. Not to, you know, say that they're the bad guys or anything like that. Mm -hmm. um, but to cut down on the cost. If anything goes wrong, they don't need a lawyer. They need somebody who will guide them through the process, who will file the paperwork on their behalf. Mm -hmm. Since they still have to go and make money for the family to pay employees and, you know, things like that. Mm -hmm. um, so the lawyer or paralegal is not a must. Mm -hmm. We can do that for them. We have all the paperwork that needs to be filed with the city. So that's not a problem. Um, we do work with few paralegals mm -hmm. um, just in case, just in case, because it does happen that mm -hmm. they get countersued. Mm -hmm. So we have somebody for them, but they will also offer them a discount mm -hmm. if it's through us. Excellent. So it may not save them a lot of money, say 5%, 10%, mm -hmm. it depends on the area. But we have people that will go out of their way and give them some sort of a discount when they need it. Exactly. So that must save them thousands of dollars by going with the service that you provide rather than going straight to the lawyers to have them file the liens, I guess, too, right? Most definitely. Um, in my personal experiences in contracting business, if we needed to file a lien mm -hmm. on a house, depends on the amount, but mm -hmm. the cheapest one we've ever found was $2,500. Oh, wow. For example, if you did a job and the client still owes you $10,000, how do you pay the $2,500 if you Great. just didn't get paid? Yeah. And what if your next job doesn't start till next month mm -hmm. okay you have only 45 days to file the lien from the moment the client says I'm not paying you oh, okay so the time is so important mm -hmm. 45 days go so fast mm -hmm. that you don't even realize oh yeah. it's gone yeah I can't do anything about it now I have to sue now I have to come up with more money exactly so what we offer is a fraction of that cost mm -hmm. and you don't need a lawyer just to start the paperwork excellent Excellent. So that's a wonderful service. So tell me, um, you offer now you offer service packages to your clients. Tell me a bit more about the packages that you offer. The packages depend on the size of the company, mm -hmm. on their needs. Yeah. Um, we have cl a client 
who's a baby in construction business. And I'm like their mother right now. <laughs> they call and they need to be guided. Right. I love those guys because they do everything as I tell them to do by the book. They haven't run right. into any problems because everything is on paper. Mm -hmm. um, but we do all sorts of services for them. Um, we'll do bookkeeping for them. Um, we'll do GST preparation for them. Um, contracts, amendments, um, we'll do payroll, electronic payroll for, that, for them. So pretty much anything involved in a small business, we can do for them. Um, say they're looking for um, employees. We have a database where we interview people on a regular basis. So we have a database of people with certain skills. Looking for a plumber? Let me pull up my database and I'll give you who's the name of the person who's looking for work in plumbing right now. Okay. So we have three different packages. Um, level one is $1,200. I know it sounds like a lot of money, but if you really break it down, it's $100 a month mm -hmm. and they don't have to pay us the full amount up front. They can go on a monthly basis, mm -hmm. which is very mm -hmm. affordable. That's our basic package. All of our packages include one lien to be filed a year, just as a protection, just like mm -hmm. insurance, really. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So what if they need to file more than one lien? Like, say they have a couple of liens in a year, because a lot of these contractors, they know they get very busy, and they're just doing one job after the other. So what if they run into a couple of problems in that year? If they're a small contractor and they run into more than two liens a year, we have a problem with the contractor. <laughs> Something's okay. wrong. Oh, okay. That's so just you, from exactly, the experience. Exactly. So you have basically, I guess, your own criteria as to who you'll take on as a client? Oh, most definitely. We mm -hmm. do um, a check on anybody that will become a member or wants to become a member of CPA. We need to check them out. Mm -hmm. Simply because not all the contractors are good guys. Mm -hmm. Not all the clients are good guys. And the other way around, not everybody's bad. And I'm not in business to hurt you as a client of a contractor if he did something wrong, if he's the shady character, okay? Mm -hmm. So that's why we do the check. We, we check with their past clients. Um, we check with Better Business Bureau. We look into, you know, who they are before we take them on as a member. We just don't want to hurt anybody. Yeah. We just want to do the right things. That's all. Yeah, exactly. So your service sounds like a, it's perfect for this contractor that's just starting out or a small contractor that their business is getting really busy. And they just don't have the time or the knowledge to take care of all these other things that need to be done. As to say, like the staffing and payroll and all these things. Because generally, like most, I find most contractors don't know about that part of it. They have to rely on somebody. Exactly. Like, oh, what a wonderful service. Exactly. My husband's still a contractor. Mm-hmm. And I still do all this for him. And he doesn't realize how much time it takes to do all his paperwork, yeah. to keep his books in order so he doesn't run into trouble. And small contractors down the road realize this. But then, you know, they bring this big box to the accountant and they get charged a lot of money mm -hmm. because the accountant has to sort through it and go over every single piece of paper and call the contractor mm -hmm. every few minutes to see, okay, what was this for? Why is it here? Where if we do this on a regular basis, bring me your receipts at least once a week if we're doing their books, then everything is quick in order mm -hmm. and you're good to go. So that's even great. if they get audited, no problem. There you go. Everything's right there for you. Mm -hmm. That's wonderful. That's wonderful. Um, so now you're located in downtown ha Hamilton, but what areas is it actually you serve? Actually, we're no longer in downtown Hamilton. Mm. Uh, we had a little situation with the location. We couldn't put a sign on the building. Oh. And it was a shared office. And I couldn't put my salesperson in the office. I didn't have room for it. So now we're, we're back in Stony Creek. We run out of a fairly big home office. Uh, we're on the mountain, Stony Creek Mountain. Um, but we serve pretty much anybody, Toronto, Oakville, Burlington, Brantford, Grimsby, Niagara Falls. It doesn't matter where you are because we are pretty much the pioneer of this. Mm -hmm. um, nobody else is touching this area. Nobody wants to <coughs> be the negotiator between the contractor and the client. Mm -hmm. Plus, it's, it's really a lot of work and I find that if it comes from your heart, uh, then you don't mind where people are located. You'll do anything in your power to help them. Excellent. So the entire, pretty well, the whole Golden Horseshoe region is pretty much where you're serving pretty right Pretty much. Now. Perfect. 
Now, another thing that Isabella does is she's also a regional leader for the Canadian Networker. So just very briefly, Isabella, tell me a little bit about that group. The Canadian Networker, I actually came across them about a month ago. Um, I got an email from somebody, you should take a look at this. So I did, and I read over some things, and I went, oh my God, this is unbelievable. You can advertise for such so little money that I was very excited, as you can tell. <laughs> Mm -hmm. um, so I decided to go after the position, not that I don't have anything to do, but, you know, I, I just love to keep busy. Yeah, so and that's wonderful. You know, so. uh, I decided that this might be something to look into, mm -hmm. because what it does, it actually brings networking groups together, mm -hmm. okay? Um, so say we're in Hamilton, but somebody lives in Toronto, but they're looking for something in Hamilton area. They'll look up the Hamilton area mm -hmm. and they'll see who is, you know, participating in the program mm -hmm. and they'll call them mm -hmm. versus, you know, going through yellow pages. Okay, what about this guy? Mm -hmm. And they have to do their own research. But with the Canadian Networker, everything's right there. Of Fabulous. Yeah. Love it. <laughs> no, and and that's great because you know, let's face it. You know, we 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 run our own network and everything, and it's wonderful to be able to access different things because if something's not available through one network, you can look through it at another one. Exactly, and, and that's great. It provides excellent resources for us right across the whole region. So it's a wonderful thing to do. Mm -hmm. So thank you so much for coming into the studio today. Isabel. Thank you for having me. You can learn more about Contractor Protection Agency through their website at contractorprotectionagency.ca or you can give them a call at 905-527-7121. This has been a People in Connection TV presentation. People in Connection specializes in internet TV and online promotions, serving the Golden Horseshoe since 1997. Have a bold business presence and start connecting today.